just talking. Oh, you know, yeah. That was a real engineering feat to get his lips to curl. How did you do this? Is it tightening or is it a serial twist? Or? Yeah, cable. We see the cable it. wrapped in there as it, as it shortens up. And, oh, it pulls in. Yeah. Oh. Cool. And you can see the inside are just a lot of mechanisms in there. I think it was a total of 17 or 19 servo motors. I see yeah. two, four, six, and eight, you, ten. And you made this one? Well, I supervised yeah, I the, uh, I was managing the creature shop at the time. Oh, okay. Here are two more and another one. Let's just say a lot. Yeah, there's a lot. Of, a lot. Yeah. And there were about six more down in his tail. Yeah, yeah that's right. Hollow tail with feathers on it. So this would have been covered with uh, foam rubber, skin, and then feathers, and his bill was painted orange, and he had skin glued to his these eyelids. eyelid mechanisms <laughs> so he could blink, and uh, you know, his, his eyes turn. And the lips. So we had two of these puppet heads, and I think we had four of the costume heads, but every day we would reskin them and refeather them. So all together we did, I think, 20, wow. somewhere between 20 and 30 of the uh, feathered heads. So we had, we had a team of girls, about 20 girls were 24 hours a day putting feathers on the on the ducks. You can see where the skin was glued on here. Oh, it's a I don't, lot of I don't know what happened to number one. <laughs> Somebody else. Somebody, Somebody else. Somebody got it. Yeah. Tired old duck. Yeah.